Hello everybody. Today Dan and I went back to Alga Farm Shop near Deal and on the counter they had this fabulous two pounds too good to waste type veg box. It's got a little bit of fruit in as well. Uh, it's vegetables that are kind of past the best. I mean this for example has a little bit of moulds that needs cutting out but the rest of it's fine and some heritage carrots and various other things and it was two pounds two quid for all this i'll show you what we got apple that one's fine that one's got a small bruise and a bit there but that can be cut out then we've got some taters there's nothing wrong with those that one is maybe slightly on the turn, but they're good jacket potatoes. They just need a scrub and the eyes picking out and then they can be baked in the oven. They make a nice supper. This tomato is a bit squashed, but we can use a little bit of that. I've got a pepper. This is a orange bell pepper. Again, a little bit needs cutting out, but the rest of it is fine. Some carrots. These are fine. They need a little bit of a scrape and a wash, but they'll be all right. These lovely heritage carrots, there's nothing wrong with those. Slightly wizened parsnip there, that one's okay. We're having something tasty for supper tomorrow, so they might go in there. More heritage carrots here. We've got whopping great purple carrots there. They'll be nice for supper tomorrow. These can all be used. More parsnips. Nothing wrong with those. Slightly floppy, but as long as they're used within the next day or two, they'll be fine. A neep. More neeps, lots of neeps. Well, it looks like we'll be having neeps and tatties with something. This is kind of a bit spongy. I think it's all right. It just needs using quickly. It's got kind of a little bit of moisture on from that squashed tomato, but that needs using in the next day or so. And then we've got a kiwi. That's going to be eaten today by Dan. And then a lovely cauliflower, massive cauliflower look. Again, it's kind of starting to go mottled in places, but it's not bad. I'll probably just cut those little bits out and that will be super in something like a cauliflower cheese. And there's enough as well to put in a soup. And what I'm going to do with a lot of this is I'm going to make a big batch of vegetable soup and probably some other things in the week. I might, for example, do a veggie casserole and then freeze it. Because we're going on holiday soon and that means if we freeze it, then we can come back to some meals without me having to work too hard. These will be a meal one night in the week, probably with a cauliflower cheese. I'll probably make a cauliflower and cheese soup as well, which is really delicious. Cheese works so well in soups. This will get used probably today. I'll leave that there. The carrots will be nice in the soup and the pepper. Apple also works in soup as well. But I might stew this and then have it with Greek yogurt for breakfast and chia seeds. I'm really into chia puddings at the moment which is just a couple of big tablespoons of full fat greek bio yogurt and a teaspoon or two of chia seeds sprinkled in given a good stir and left overnight absolutely yummy and full of omega-3 and these carrots will also get eaten this weekend and that's our two pound box you don't have to spend a lot of money to eat well. Even if you have to do a little bit of prep work, it's well worth the effort. 
See you again soon. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my content. And I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.